I have a good feeling about this one. Well, fast foodies, even though it is not summer time right now, I am still going to be reviewing some s'mores flavored snacks. And not just any snacks, these, my fast foodie nation, are campfire s'mores M&Ms. And the reason why I'm going to be trying out these campfire s'mores M&Ms, even though it's almost the exact opposite of summer time, it's almost minter time when everything is about to be mint flavored. The reason why I'm going to be trying out these campfire s'mores M&Ms is, well, there are two reasons. The first, it's never a bad time to have a s'more. Come on, come on. That classic combination of graham crackers, marshmallow, and chocolate, it just gets me in the heart, in the fast foodies heart, every time. And the second reason why I'm going to be trying out these Campfire S'mores M&Ms is, well, because I've never had them before. And the reason why I'm the king of the fast foodies is because whenever I see a new snack, fast food item, cereal, ice cream, candy, whatever maybe that I haven't had before, and I think that you guys will like to see a review of, you better believe that I am going to pick it up and, well, review it for you guys. And so when I saw these at my local Walgreens, I believe, I picked them up like that. And here we are. All right, now before I go ahead and try out these campfire s'mores, there's one more thing you guys gotta do. Hit that subscribe button. Now I wonder if each M&M will taste like a s'more or you know, one M&M will taste like a marshmallow, another like chocolate, another like uh, graham cracker. You gotta like put them together. Yeah, so it looks like we have a few different colors, three, three different colors. We have uh, a white, an orange, and a black. I'm gonna try the white first. I assume if each one would be a separate flavor, then the white would probably be marshmallow. Nope, you get some more, pretty sure. Yeah. Each one tastes like a s'more. They did a pretty good job. I think the two strongest flavors are definitely the marshmallow and the chocolate, which honestly, it's kind of to be expected. The marshmallow is kind of easy, easy to replicate. Same with the chocolate. The graham cracker, I get hints of it, but I do think the graham cracker could be a little bit more pronounced. But still, managing to encompass three different flavors in one tiny M&M. That's pretty impressive. Um, you know what you could do? Get a graham cracker, put some of these s'more M&Ms on the graham cracker, toast the marshmallow, put the marshmallow on, put a thing of Hershey's chocolate and another graham cracker. So you have a s'more within a s'more, s'moreception. <laughs> Maybe one day. Um, we don't have marshmallows in the household right now. Ratings though? <sighs> Let's go with a nine out of 10. These were good. Definitely recommend picking them up if you guys find them in your local Walgreens. Like I said, I've never seen them before and I'm always looking for new and interesting snacks. So. I don't know, because usually they say like limited edition or new on new flavors of m and So maybe it's like, a, you know, they were new a long time ago and then they're all sold out except for this one Walgreens that had them. I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below if you've ever seen them. Um, but yeah, definitely check these out, especially when it's summertime. Oh, it's going to be such a long time though. Oh, well, at least this, uh, this makes me think of summer, smummer. So there's that. See you guys in the next one. If you made it to the end of this video, then I'm sure that you want to become a fast foodie as well. So all you have to do is hit that subscribe button. And to see exclusive behind the scenes footage, then you can head on over to Instagram and follow the fast foodies at fast foodies review.